Well, it's Wednesday. And you know what that means, my friends. It is time for Chad's Corner. No one puts Chad in a corner except for me. And I like to call Chad Chadwick, and I must say, Chadwick, I am here. This is chocolate? Absolutely. Color? Heck yeah. Oh, you are looking <laughs> fly. Yeah, I try. No haircut, beard yeah. trim. A little bit. Yeah. Little, you know, Ladies, gotta get, gotta get, it's, it's January. You got a new chain. Play on, play on. He is out and about covering Thank all you. of our sports, too. Absolutely. So, up first, I'm actually so excited. Aren't you excited? Talking Texans we and got playoffs. Playoffs. We're in playoffs, playoffs? yo. We're, we're, we we're playing Frostville for a championship, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Super Bowl. You know, I'm, I'm not going to go that far because it's, you take it one game at a time. Right. But Texans hosting the Cleveland Browns in the walk, Super Wild Card round. Right. Uh, Saturday, 3.30 at Energy Stadium. Uh, Texans underdog at home, but the reason they're underdog at home is because mostly because of injuries. But, right. you know, C.J. Stroud obviously playing well. The last time they played against Cleveland, C.J. Stroud was injured and Cleveland had a big game. Right. You know, they got they the win. Lucky. They were they, lucky. They, they, they had a good game, you know. So, C.J. Stroud's healthy. Mm -hmm. The problem is, not that many, many Texans are, you know. Will Anderson's beat up. Wide receivers are beat up. You know, offensive line people beat up. Larry Tunsil's beat up. Will Anderson's hurt. So, Texans have to get healthy. Jerry Hughes as well beat up. So, the Texans have to get healthy, so let's, you know, D'Amico Ryans knows yeah. this, and he's got, you he know, he, 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 he said it straight up at a press conference yesterday, so let's hear what he had to say. Yeah, man, <clears throat> we would love to get all of our guys back and be as healthy as we can for this game. I mean, we just, for us, it doesn't matter who's been out there or who was out there last time. Like, we just got to play better. You put the tape on from last game, and you see <clears throat> instantly it wasn't good enough, right? So we got to just play better in that regard, no matter who's out there. Hey, you never know you never what know. someone can do. Yeah, I mean, they, they obviously you never know who's going to, you know, get that little adrenaline and get healthy. You don't know. And so at home, they've got the support. In fact, C.J. Stroud. He talked about playing here. And that energy could help lift that team. And C.J. Stroud, who's a rookie, this is going to be interesting for him. And he even talked about it as well. Let's listen to what he had to say. Yeah, it's super cool. I can't wait to see NRG and how loud and, and excited the fans are going to be. Um, I'm really excited to play my first playoff game, of course. And it's been a goal of mine since I've been a kid. I've always watched it and things like that, like you said. So I'm really excited and, and um, just ready to roll. I'm excited. Okay, so let's break down the schedule. I think that we have yeah. a whole map about the schedule. We'll get, you know, Texans win, but let's take a look at the 2024 schedule just well, so you know. Oh, that, oh, this schedule. is a playoff schedule. We'll yeah. take a look at 2024 later. But the Texans win. They are. They will go on the road. They'll either be playing either at Baltimore oh. or, or, you know, or probably at Kansas City, which oh. is just as cold. No, it's just a tough team. Yeah, too. they may play at Buffalo. Or if they get lucky, you know, the Texans could play at home. They need both Kansas City. City and uh, Buffalo to lose, or that's else. hard in my house. That's you know, I know, I know, I'm, I know, I know you're. I know, you know, I know, you I know. Hefe is a big Bills fan, yeah. so. But if that happens, Texans could still host the divisional playoff at home. <sighs> Meanwhile, on the other side, bracket the NFC, we got to talk about the Cowboys. They're playing. They're hosting the Packers yeah. on the wild card on Sunday. You got the uh, Rams going to Detroit, and then you got Philly and Tampa Bay. That's on a Monday night. Now, let, now the key game we're going to talk about is the Miami KC game. Okay, so this is a thing that we've been talking about and a lot of people are really ticked because some of the games are being played on a paying streaming service. Yeah. Like you've got to have like Peacock or something like that. Yeah, you need Peacock to watch that game. And that's the, the reality kind of how the NFL is. NFL loves making money, okay? Let's put it that way. Yeah, they got it on Amazon. <laughs> then they got, yeah, they have Thursday night games on Amazon. You have to have Amazon Prime to watch those. And now you got to have Peacock to watch okay, a cool. playoff game. But here, I, I thought I'd ask the viewers because I'm kind of fired up about this. And a lot of you guys, you have to log on over over on my social media. So Tom, he said terrible money grabbing move. They will lose viewership and fan base because of it. Tommy, too much money. Jay Christian, he said, I feel like NFL fans are getting shortchanged. We just want to see our favorite teams play. Nard, he says it's awful having to find out if you already are paying for the streaming service or not. Steve, he does not like it. Richard, I'll suffer the commercials. Thanks. 
And then Debbie says she's not paying. So a lot of people are like, this is a waste of time and money, that the NFL is being greedy. I get it's a business. And if you are local, like, they will still show yeah. the local games. If you live in Kansas City or Miami, you're oh, getting the game over the air. But everybody else, you, got, if you don't have Peacock, you don't have Peacock. I will say if you have Xfinity, for those who have cable out there, Xfinity, you can get Peacock for free, so you can just turn it on and do it for that. But if you don't, I'm sorry, you're just going to have to pony up the money to watch the game. The hey, but you know yet. what? Because but you, you can get a week. Free. You can't get a week free. Also, you know, hey, go out to a local sports bar. Hey, yeah, and watch the game. Local. Support a support a good Quick restaurant. Look. We only have 30 seconds left. Here is a look at our opponents. For yeah, the next obviously, the, yeah, obviously the three AFC South opponents there. Buffalo's coming in. I know, Woo -hoo, I know, I'll be there. I know, Hefe, I know you're going to be ready for that, but here's the games on the road. A little interesting thing at the bottom. Uh, we're going to make it a trip up to Jerry World. I want to go. Yeah. I, 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 I'm, Can we do a road trip? I'm going to do a road trip. We're going to do that. So right. get, make your plans. The, the real schedule comes out in the summertime.